right, we're here at 2087 Edgewater Drive, Unit C. We've got a toilet pulled here, and we're going to drop down inside of this closet flange and see what we can see. Looks like already at the base of this line, there's a buildup. There we go, we've gotten through that. here then we go up into the next toilet come back this way and see if we missed a an opportunity to turn. That just looked like a 45. up that toilet again. Let's see if I can get a little water trickling through that toilet. I've got water trickling through that toilet. Let's see which way it goes here. Obviously it's following this toilet back. Got a little belly right here in the line. And this is where it starts coming up the flange that I went down through. see it coming up the closet flange up the 90 the back side of my camera so just on the other side of this there's got to be a, a Y going the opposite direction Let's see if I can push all this stuff out of here so I can get a clearer view Instead of a combo, or if it's a combo, it's going the wrong direction just on the backside behind the closet flange. Go give that other toilet a full flush and see if we can knock this stuff out. 
Okay, so after several minutes of playing with this here, I finally got it turned the other direction. Actually go downstream. So I'm coming up the vertical pipe now, getting back into the horizontal. some of this water in here. So that's the way I couldn't go before, to the right. I kept going to the left. It goes real easily to the left. This fitting here is where all of the toilet paper buildup was, not allowing anything to flow. Bounce this a few times, see if I can get it go back in that pipe again. There we go. So now we've got on the other side of that fitting where it's supposed to be going downstream. Obviously, we've got a belly. From the fitting. I might, might have broke something loose there. I hear water flowing through it again. that a second to stop running the water. Alright, pretty much looks like that stopped flowing. Let's see if there's actually a belly in this line. Should be right at that fitting. I'm gonna go flush that toilet. Alright, so now we know that line is completely clear. Shouldn't be any debris left in there. Let's push it through. See if we what we can find for bellies or anything else in the line here.
here's the drop down the vertical line. So as we pull back, we'll be at a better decision on what type of water that thing's holding. My camera lens is approximately quarter inch off the, maybe half inch off the floor of the pipe. holding well, probably less than a quarter inch of water in the line so I wouldn't call that a big terrible belly but I think as we get back here where the toilet flushes into this point and instead of going the direction of flow it ends up flushing up this way and leaving all of the toilet paper deposits right here in this fitting causing everything to back up and this is basically just under wall from the closet flange as you see we go down the closet flange it goes back towards the wall fitting and then in the wrong direction thanks for watching